Ladies and gentlemen, we, welcome back to HWA. We're getting into our first contest. And it seems that first to come out is a uh, very unusual character. Somebody new to the HWA scene. We got a lot of. I think we call him Sicko the Clown. That's an interesting looking individual there, wouldn't you say so, Skeeter? Would you say that's an inter interesting looking wrestler there, Skeeter? I've seen. God, I have. All these funny, pretty technical issues, but there. No, I just your screen. Straight out of the dark corner. I. It's to go the crowd. I love the voice. Yeah. And I would have met with anybody. He, he, he wants a. Anybody. He's doing an open challenge on his. Love this crowd. I don't even got to do the punchline. First day of the job. <laughs> Who's this? <laughs> Kid oh, Kia. Yeah. Kid yeah. Kia. Yeah. The rookie. Sicko the Clown calls out a, his first mat or his first uh, contestant, and it happens to be Let's Kid Kia. Kia. Someone else who is also new to the scene of HWA, in a sense. This guy owns Pin Falls over Poncho, and he pinned Madman in the gauntlet. He's slowly getting his name out there. Building a slight reputation here in the HWA. And now he's, he's got to go up against this unusual character. Definitely uh, one of the oddest looking Bell. people we've had in HWA history. Bell has not officially rung a toe right there. We're underway with the opener. We got a lock up here by Sicko and Kid Kia. Arm wrench by Sicko the Clown. Thank you was hyped over Facebook. Straight out of the dark carnival. And it don't get much darker than that, folks. And we got a jumping DDT there by Sicko. He gets a pin. And I must say impressive 80s hairdo. Oh, yeah. Here, here Running Kia's, neither. He has ever changing hairdo. We saw what he was. We saw his hairstyle at Golden Opportunity. A little less colorful than Bozo, though. Oh, yeah, true. The kid Kia impressing HWA officials, including Jimmy J. Impress them enough in his opening contest. Definitely no weird looking. To get nice back suplex there. Position and did very well. Yeah. This man is slowly becoming the upset special of HWA. Ah! We got a knee there by uh, Kid Another Kia. Knee to the oh, ooh. Ooh. knee to the head. He seems to like the knee people. <laughs> Do it again. I like it. I want to steal the lady kick off this. The Diz purposely or Phoenix supposedly purposely injuring the freak in that hardcore match. And the Diz has stripped him of the title and has dropped the 24-7 roll. It says, oh! Kia went for a dive oh. to the outside. Oh. Just to get anyway, kicked the, in the, the stomach. The hardcore title's been vacated and crowned, I believe, next Ooh. next show. Oh. And now Phoenix has challenged the Diz for critical condition. Oh. Back to the way He pulls the shirt over his head just oh. to kick him. Get back to this action here. He throws Kid Kia back into the ring. As I said, this is the first show after an incredible golden opportunity where we just we saw just about everything and more. Oh, what a show. Incredible. What a show. Did you say Madman WK so hadn't been pinned by Kid Kia? But we Kid saw Kid titles. We saw <laughs> gold briefcases. Fire and light tubes. Fun. Oh! oh! What was this? That looked like a rock bottom. And a two cop. We saw thumbtacks. We saw computer monitors. We saw swords. Tiki torches. Back to the torches. Back to yeah. the action here. We had a we had a two count and a kick out by Kid Kia. And a, a car seat and a and a cooler. And just about everything. He smacks Kid Kia in the that face. Was, He's oh. got him up. And we got an airplane spin here. Oh! And he drops straight down from an airplane spin. He goes for the pin. Can he beat Kia? No! Oh, it's a Not kick a out of two. That was a close two count there. He's surviving so far. I think I'm going to steal his boots for some bondage action. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt you guys. I just received word from backstage. Main event tonight is Dimitri for the heavyweight title. Dimitri won him. I'm not the golden quite sure what they were doing right there, but I think they kicked each Double other. Drop kick they both went for a drop kick. Like I said, Dimitri, the only CCW champion in existence, is now going to get a shot at HWA Gold. Oh, yeah. 
Dimitri coming up short in the Golden Gauntlet. But he, he, however, he did, he did hold the, the belt for quite back. some time towards the end of that match, if you remember correctly. Exactly. Exactly. It seemed like it was going to be Dimitri versus the world, but unfortunately, he did not get the victory. Uh, yeah, yeah, Man, man, and the freak working together. Kid was Kia going up the top here. What's he going to do? Match. Yep. Oh, oh flash! Kid Kia lands it. This could be the end of the match if he could just roll himself over there. Unfortunately, that affects both the wrestlers. We got a pin. Kick out by Sicko the Clown. He held the briefcase at one point in the match. Pin Man Man. That Which is, is no, not a lot of people can say that. that. That's pretty impressive for somebody just starting off. Wouldn't you agree? Oh, yeah. Oh, is it just me or do those boots look like they belong in an SMN porno? <laughs> Psycho Joe, ladies and gentlemen. Fisherman oh, Suplex! Just saying, okay? Just saying. I'd use them, but you know, that's beside the point. <laughs> hey, look, he's using the mini ladder. He's going to the midget several ladder. Aerial he's slightly areas. going up. <laughs> Does it go halfway up? <laughs> Did he double axe handle to the we face, I believe? A couple to we saw that use a golden opportunity, and that was the apparent spot where Phoenix fell off the ladder and landed on uh, Diz's knee. Fun stuff. I don't know about you guys, but it looks look like an honest accident, you know? Yeah. In my that opinion, ladder. yes, but when we have someone like the Diz running things... Oh, full Nelson slam. Diz cannot tell a ladder from a chair. And it's a shame. I wanted to see how Phoenix would run as the hardcore champion. He's going Here for another go. Oh! oh. Sicko gets the knees up at the last Kia, second, though. Kia rolling to the outside is Sicko. The match is going back and forth. Two. Referee with a count three. of three. <laughs> Can't quite hear the ref. <laughs> just saying. Oh. Just saying. Psycho Joe and his verbal criticism. I love that laugh. It tickles me every time. <laughs> it, sc it scares the hell out of me. Two count. Is it bad that it tickles me in bad places? You know, some some know. kids are afraid of clowns. For some reason, I think Psycho Joe is very comfortable. Kids and my brother. Bubba. What's wrong with clouds? <laughs> at least a la at least this one might actually give me a you know a balloon that's shaped like something cool. Oh, oh kick to the outside. <laughs> I don't know. If this guy will give me gifts, unlike these last set of clowns, you know, I might actually. Nice suplex to the inside of the ring. He is a guy, new guy trying to get into the title picture. And what is this? Oh, is this? Sharpshooter, maybe. Yep, that's what. Oh. Up and over by the great Bret Hart. He's got it locked in. Sicko trying to reach the end. Sicko has nowhere to go. He has nowhere to go. Oh, he's, he's, he's trying. He's, he's, he's trying. He got it. Oh, oh, he, he, he had to let it go. <laughs> well, from what I've seen, Kid Key is not exactly the dirtiest wrestler that we have on the roster. <laughs> Very new. Yeah. And as Jesse Ventura would say, win if you must, lose if you have to, but always cheat. <laughs> oh, is this a pet? Oh! Oh! That is. by Kid Kia. Is this it? <laughs> He's just using yes, everything, man. and we got a victory yeah. here by Kid Kia. Kid Kia with a pedigree Woo! puts out Sicko in his HWA debut. That was definitely an interesting match, to say the least. Sicko the Clown is uh, an odd individual. He's not happy about this. <laughs> I don't know what to say. His own reactions are quite funny. We will continue here at HWA.